at this stage of my life, I just don't think we're going to be able to do videos together anymore. Callie, wait, honey. Oh. Today's video is about to take a crazy turn. Since today is April Fool's Day, I am going to be pranking Callie big time. So pretty much, you guys, I'm going to be picking her up in like five minutes and we're going to go get some Starbucks. While we're on our way to Starbucks, I'm going to tell her that I have something important to tell her. She's going to be so confused. And then as we are drinking our Starbucks, we're going to park. And then I'm going to be pranking her by telling her that we are not going to be filming any videos together anymore. We're not going to be seeing each other. I'm going to make something up and say that I'm going to be doing more like makeup tutorials and personal vlogs and that I don't know maybe I'm gonna work on a clothing line it's the end of an era and ah, guys I actually feel so bad though like this is gonna be so sad honestly I'm gonna have a hard time doing this I don't know how she's going to react I have a feeling she's probably going to just get really quiet she may cry I don't know or she might try really hard to hold it together and take a more mature approach guys let me know how you think she's going to react I cannot believe I'm doing this. Literally, this was requested by you guys so much, and you guys had so many fun ideas for what I should do as an April Fool's Day prank this year, and I decided to do this one because I think it is the most believable. Obviously, at the end, I'm going to be telling her that this was all a prank. So just remember throughout this video, this is not real. Don't get upset because it's fake. But guys, let me know what pranks you pulled on your family and friends today. If you did, you don't have to, obviously. Or if you haven't pulled any pranks yet, are you gonna be? Let me know in the comments down below. But anyways, guys, let's go pick up Callie and get this thing started. Ah, I'm so nervous. A little longer than a few minutes later. Hello. Hey guys, I have Callie. Hey. And what are we about to do right now? Starbucks. Getting our dream Starbucks drinks. Yes, our dream Starbucks drinks. Callie's been looking up some options. What are you thinking? I don't know yet, actually. Did you say like a Sour Patch Kids? Yeah, I'm gonna get that one now. It's a lemonade. It has like a lot of like strawberry puree and stuff in it. And I thought that would be bad. There's a s'mores frappuccino. It's very good. You've never had a s'mores frappuccino before? Oh my gosh. I love that I'm one. I'm looking at Pinterest because that's where I get all my amazing Starbucks ideas. So guys, I think I am going to get a banana split frap. Um, they put an actual banana in it. I gotta find the recipe. I've seen it before and it sounds amazing. I might get one that I've already gotten before that I've really liked. Also, Callie, um, I just wanted to let you know, while we're drinking our Starbucks, just a little heads up, um, I do have something I want to talk to you about and uh, I'll probably vlog it because it's something important that relates to the channel. What happened? No, it's, um, honestly, I'm going to wait to talk about it until we get there. Don't get all worked up, okay? I don't want you to assume the worst, okay. but... Anyways, don't want to like stress you out or anything, but I just wanted to let you know. It's all good. We'll have our Starbucks chat a little bit and it'll be okay. Okay. I shouldn't have said anything. I should have just waited until we got there because now you're going to be thinking about it. I'm sorry. Breathe. Breathe. It's okay. I'm confused, guys. Anyways. Do you guys know? Do they know? Um, no. It, it's just an announcement that I've been needing to make. Okay. Um relating to the channel. I mean, you can tell me now and like, I'll act surprised when you actually tell me what's wrong with Starbucks. No, we'll wait. But anyways, okay, we're gonna change the subject because I don't want Callie to overthink it. Guys, comment below. If you could have any custom Starbucks drink, what would it be? Ooh. I would want, if they could create like an actual really good birthday cake flavored one, that's what I would say. Technically, you can order that, but like, in my opinion, it always just tastes like the vanilla bean frap, and I'm not a fan. Anyways, yeah, you guys, we just wanted to say hey, and uh, we will update you whenever we are in line at Starbucks, and we'll tell you what our official drink orders are. Five minutes later. All right, guys. I'm going on my way to drive, so what did you need to tell me? Oh, <laughs> not yet, Callie, not yet. Ah. Wait. It's been killing her, literally. We just got to Starbucks, you guys, and she's been asking me nonstop, what is it? You can tell me off camera, and then I'll act surprised. Just tell me. And I'm like, girl, we have to wait. We have to wait. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't get it. I don't know what she told you. Are you hiding something? No. If I was hiding something, I wouldn't be telling you today. I would keep it a secret. 
um so like yeah it's right now kind mm -hmm. of until i tell you but anyways you guys so i am definitely going to get the banana split frap and callie is being indecisive so she said she wants the barista to surprise yes. her with a frappuccino of their choice so I bet you she's going to give you a caramel ribbon crunch frap. Okay, do you know what you should get? What should I get? You should get the chicken, maple, butter, and egg sandwich. Oh, that sounds like a lot. Oh, guys, I have this horrible toothache. I'm pretty sure I have an infected tooth. And I literally didn't think I was going to be able to way, see Callie today. This if some food, then this will be good. It's a very trio parfait. It's yogurt, strawberries, Ooh. and like oatmeal, I think. An oatmeal. 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 <laughs> oatmeal. I like oatmeal. Oatmeal. <laughs> Why is that funny right now? I don't know. That's such an old man food. Yeah, guys, I didn't even know that Starbucks had bananas. Because for my recipe, it requires like a banana. Start with the strawberries and cream frappuccino. Add vanilla bean powder, java chips, add a whole banana, topped with whipped cream and mocha drizzle. That sounds so good. I'm just gonna say, hey, surprise me and a surprise me frappuccino. Guys, what do you think her surprise frappuccino flavor is gonna be? I'm voting caramel. I'm voting that I like make it like really oh. creative. Can you hold this please? Wait. Hi there, welcome to Starbucks. Can I get you started off with any kind of sandwich or pastries today? Uh, yes. Can we do one blueberry muffin? Thank you. One, you said blueberry muffin? Yes. Understood, anything else for you? And then I'm gonna do a custom drink. All right, what's the drink? Okay, so it's gonna be a grande, um, and it says to start with the strawberries and cream frap. Gotcha. And then add vanilla bean powder, and then add java chips. Anything else? A whole banana. Uh, okay, so unfortunately we do not have bananas anymore. Oh, okay, uh, okay, scratch that, sorry. No worries. One second. Panic, 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 panic. Let's just do the, uh, Found it, found it. Oh found wait, it. never mind, never mind, we found it, okay. Um, so it's a strawberries and cream frappuccino with uh, two pumps of white mocha and whipped cream. Two pumps of white mocha, and I'm so sorry, what else? And uh, whipped cream, please. Gotcha, anything else? If you could just surprise us with whatever frappuccino you want. Hmm. Gotcha, all right, challenge accepted. Thank you so much. All right, Ooh. we will see you down here in the window. All right, sounds good. Thank you. Uh-huh. What was awkward? It was like, we were trying to find him scrambling and he was, there's just a line behind us. Like, oh, poor guy. He's like, I'm so sorry. You're like, no, I'm so sorry. It might rain at 12 p.m. <gasps> Great. <gasps> that means we can make TikToks at the clock <gasps> when it's raining. TikTok on the clock, but the party don't stop. No, whoa, 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 oh, 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 oh. Wow, we were so annoying together. I love it. I said a movie theater. The king is <laughs> We're not really good in the movie theater. At least oh once, every time we go to the movies, someone like gives us a, a glare. Or one time this lady actually said, can you please keep it down? It was really at the end of the movie when they were doing a panorama of the house. Like, that's the least important part. Can I put this here? Yeah. Like, the least important part of the movie, like, doing a panorama of the house. Like, so Kayla took a sweet rope, okay? Let's just say Oh, a this. sweet rope, yeah, it's a kind and of candy. And she went like this. And flicked, flicked it. it. And it went like this, straight up. It was shocked. <laughs> Went and for some reason that was so funny to us like hilarious it was because we knew we had to be quiet yeah it's yeah. like you know when you're not supposed to do something or you'll be supposed to be quiet and you want to do the exact opposite of that and then it's just extra funny Callie, i have a feeling yours is actually gonna end up being better than mine because our barista was fun it wasn't like one of those real serious ones we're like yeah. okay well we can't really do that or just like punch in you know anything he's like okay Challenge accepted. accepted. So. So I think it's gonna be really good. I feel like it is too. I'm like, I'm, in a way, I'm kind of nervous. I'm excited. Is someone beeping at me? No, someone's calling going off because, yeah. Oh, okay. I'm like, what am I? I always think it's my fault. <laughs> Listen to Dumb Ways to Die. You listen to it? Dumb Ways Ready? to Die. A sheen ad. Man. He set his hair on fire. He played with the bear. This is a TikTok trend. I know. It'll be fun if we could do one. A few moments later. Ew, a split end. Ew. I 
need to clean my car. All right, hey guys. So we just got our drinks and Callie's surprise drink, I believe is a cotton candy frap because we are reading the label. Oh, it is. And it says vanilla bean frap with raspberry pumps. Three, two, two, one. Mmm. It's just good. Tastes like cotton candy. Scott, this brings back so many memories. That taste. Oh, what does it remind you of? My friend, like we would always get Starbucks together. Mm. And I would always get this. It was like three or four years ago and I would Aww. always get this. I used to get that all the time too. I liked it when they would make it pink. I don't know why it's not pink anymore. It'd be so much more attractive, but yeah. So they surprised Kylie with a cotton candy frap and I got the, what is this called again? Strawberry shortcake frap? I think so. Yeah, you guys heard me order it. It is amazing. So, okay, now we have a little treats. Oh, I got a muffin too. I took a bite out of it. I cheated it a little bit. Oh, yeah. It looks good. It looks very good. It's warm. Oh, good. So we're going to have a little meeting here, okay? Little uh, Starbucks chit-chat meeting. All right, so, hmm. I feel so awkward doing this right now. Um, Yeah, I should take my seatbelt off too. Relax. Are you going to do one of those pranks like where you like pretend you're going to tell me something but you never do? No, but I'm, I'm literally fidgeting with my straw wrapper right now because like, okay, Callie, um, <clears throat> I don't want to get emotional. What do you mean? Like, okay, first, first, I just want you to know that what I'm about to tell you, like this decision, it's not something that I thought of overnight. This has been a long time coming and I have been debating on doing this for months now honestly ever since like november Wait, are you moving? Yeah. no 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 i'm not moving it, it doesn't have anything to okay, do with moving good. it i'm not moving okay um Wait. however i don't i honestly don't know how you're going to take this i mean okay basically callie um you know how we film videos together every week like mm -hmm. we do the shopping challenges and yeah and all of that so uh, don't get me wrong they're so fun and you know I love them and our audience loves them but I am getting older and for a while I've been wanting to do kind of like a channel transformation where I do more uh, personal vlogs and makeup tutorials and another thing that I've been really wanting to do recently is start a clothing line and update the merch shop and a lot of things that would require me to work independently. Um, so uh, there's really no easy way to put this. I'm having a hard time even looking at you right now because I, I genuinely don't want to, like my goal right now is not to upset you. I don't want you to know that, okay? I care about you so much. Um, but at this stage of my life, I just don't think we're going to be able to do videos together anymore. Callie, wait, honey, Callie. Oh, I was afraid this would happen, you guys. She's literally out there like crying. Oh gosh, did I, was I too harsh? I hope I wasn't too harsh, but oh God. I gotta get her to come back in here though because she's gonna, come on. She's literally so upset. Callie. <laughs> You don't have to show your face right now. I understand if you're feeling sad. But listen, 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 okay? It's not all bad. Honey, I didn't think you'd be so upset. I just like seeing you. <laughs> well, listen, we can still see each other. We can get lunch, you know, like on, once a month or something. We can go out for lunch once a month. Or, you know, I could spontaneously pick you up and we get ice cream. Uh, we could still do TikToks together. Um, it's just, you know, for right now, it, it's just not really, I feel like I've kind of outgrown it, I guess. And it, it's just so repetitive. And, um, I'm so happy that you have such a fun time doing it with me. That means so much to me. And obviously I love hanging out with you too, but you know, it, it's not like we're not going to see each other again. I'm not moving. It's just, you know, again, at, at this stage of my life, it's just not, it's just not viable. I need to move forward and I need to try new things. And Callie, well, I think it's safe to say you lost your appetite. Um, what can I do to make it better? I'm so sorry. Is there anything I could do to make you feel better about yes. this? You can say April 4th! 
So it was a double prank. So don't worry, no emotional damage done here. She's fine. She knew about it the whole time. Actually, emotional damage. <laughs> when she got out of the car, we like I'll put the clip in here. She was actually laughing. We were laughing at each other, and then I had to like get back into character. She wasn't actually running around the parking lot crying or anything. She, we were actually laughing. I was just standing out there. She was just standing out there. So um, I have to burp. Wait, excuse me. Anyway, nice. <laughs> thanks. But yes, guys. Uh, just to clarify for the fifth time, uh, that was not true. I'm not going to start a clothing line. And she told me that I was like. Okay. Okay, Khloe Kardashian. <laughs> I don't mean like a bougie clothing line. I mean yeah. like a, a cute one. That was all a prank. You don't need to unsubscribe uh, or hate me. Um, it's fake. Okay. I feel like that. Like some people like who don't know are gonna have a suspicion before because it will be posted on April first. Yeah. So that's a good question. So when you guys clicked on this video today, did you know that it was a prank or did you believe it? And also, did you believe Callie's reaction or did you think she was acting? I think you did a really good job. I definitely would have assumed that that was real, especially because I told them ahead of time that you didn't know. She pranked you that I didn't know, but I did know. Yes. So it was two in one. We were planning it out like literally on the way here. So yes, guys, breathe. We are still going to be making fun content for you. You, okay, this duel is going nowhere. Yeah, all right. It's a duel that you cannot. Split you up. cannot break it. You just can't. No, okay. It's like it's like trying to break iron. It, it would take the whole entire world crashing down on us. Or until one of us dies. <laughs> That's gruesome. Or until one of us dies. But if one of us dies, I hope, I hope I die first. Cause, Cause I don't wanna live without you. I don't wanna ever learn how to fall asleep without you. Tell me what's worse, missing you now or later. Maybe I can break the curse, and I can be in love forever if I die first. So yes, you guys, that was all for this video. If you fell for it, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Even if you didn't like it, give it a big thumbs up. <laughs> yes, and um, if you have skin, <laughs> give it a thumbs up. If you have skin and a brain, okay, give us a some thumbs up. don't have brains. Some people, some people have brains, but they're just like nocturnal. Exactly. Like all the time, permanently. If <laughs> you are a girl, if you are a boy, if you are a person, give us a thumbs up. And also guys, one more thing. Let us know in the comments below the best prank you've ever played on somebody. But anyways, you guys, we are going to get going now. Thank you all so much for watching and we will talk to you in the next video. Bye. Mwah. Happy April 4th.